Hi guys, welcome to a new video here at Total Cards. Um, today we are going to be opening the new Dragon Ball Mythic Booster Box. Um, myself, Josh, just here by myself today. And yeah, so as you can see there, we've got three booster boxes. These guys, uh, yeah, looking forward to opening these. So we will uh, get straight into it. Um, been looking forward to these guys coming out for a while now. Uh, great set for all your all the cards that kind of you've you've been wanting. Lots of lots of lovely reprints here. Lots of lovely cards from uh, uh, tournaments. Very popular indeed. And I'll just take a look at a couple there. Just the artwork, as per guys, with the Dragon Ball stuff. I don't think you really get much better artwork uh, on many other TCGs, if any, in my opinion, at least. Um, yeah, they just look really good. But yeah, gonna jump into it. Um, packs do feel a little, a little bit thinner maybe than than the other ones that I'm used to there. Um, but yeah, we'll get this one open for you guys, and we'll see what we got. Uh, to start, I'll probably just flick through them, see what we got, and then. As we open up a couple more boxes, we'll stack it in faster and faster and get to the good stuff because I know that's what uh, that's what everybody wants to see, really. But we'll start off with the Broly, uh, Son Goku, Mafuba, Broly Legends Dawning, lovely looking card there. It's the leader one, so got the double sided as well. Son Goku, the last straw, Revive Ravager Vegeta, SS4 Bardock. Oh, and a lovely Dimension Magic. Very. Uh, very popular card you get this one in there uh, some of the starter decks as well um just a new kind of art on it there but yeah very very nice and i'll be putting of course the more expensive stuff is getting all sleeved up today as it always does um and we'll be using the lovely vault x soft sleeves today so if you guys are on the lookout for any soft sleeves and you're not sure which ones you want to pick up maybe maybe you're not too much of a fan of ultra pro or game genic or uh, you never heard of Vault X before? I'd, I'd definitely give them a whirl. Um, they're some of the uh, the best best products I've definitely used. Uh, I've got a couple binders of them, and uh, yeah, they do. Uh, they are absolutely solid. There we go. We've got Sun Goku, Nimbus Master. Ooh, a lovely looking unbreakable Super Saiyan Sun Goku there. That is very nice. You just just with the way that the energy beams come off, like when he's doing the uh, the Kamehameha wave there with the, the gold. That was really nice. That was really, really nice. I do love it. But yeah, so if you want any any sleeves or binders, anything like that, then uh, give them a look. That is Vault X. Uh, very, very popular amongst our customers. Definitely so. My lord. These packs are getting more and more difficult to get into. Do you know what would help if I used the little slip that they have? You know, <laughs> not used to having the little cut on them. Most TCGs don't have that, but no. Dragon Ball do, head of the game, eh? Right, flick through one of these a bit faster. Super Saiyan, full Son Goku there. Oh, that's nice. Bardock Surge of Inspiration. Wow. Wow. It's very nice. But yeah, guys, do bear with me if I don't uh, immediately figure out that a card is kind of insane value. Because um, I've been looking forward to this one, but... Um, yeah, been so busy with everything else that I've not had much chance to look at all the card lists yet. But yeah, I'm sure hopefully today we'll pull something really good and we will be very happy. Oh, that one's very nice, that one. Probably Surge of Brutality. That's lovely. I'm gonna get that one in shiny. Oh, another Son, Son Goku. Oh, 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 there we go. There we go, there we go. As I was just saying, I don't know what's gonna be one of the best cards, but yeah, that one there. That one there, guys. That is the one that we want. Vegeta Peak of Primitive Power. SCR. I think that's the third pack or the fourth pack, so maybe that's that's a sign of things to come, or maybe this is as good as it's gonna get today, but wow. Wow. I just wanna put that even closer, show you guys. But yeah, look at that. Oh, so nice. Don't even have words. Don't even have words. Yeah, very nice indeed. I know that a lot of people, certainly here at Talk Cards as well, uh, maybe collect Dragon Ball more than more than they play. Personally, I, I like to play myself. I, I, I find it quite enjoyable. A couple of the guys here uh, are always up for a game. But if you are collecting it, then I absolutely do not blame you whatsoever. That is, that is, if you're getting cards like that, then 
it's something to show off in your binders and oh, it's, just, it's just so lovely. There we go, got a Super Saiyan Trunks there. Some go, uh, go 10, Awakening the Beast. Very nice, very nice. There we go. There it is again, the Vegeta on the pack there, so yeah, kind of showing what he's all about. <clears throat> get into this next one. Here we go. But yeah, if you guys have picked up any of these boxes, let us know in the comments what uh, what cards you got or what cards you, you really like from this set. Just drop them down below. Uh, we'll have a look at them for sure. Kefla Everlasting Light. Wow, so nice. Um, and obviously a lot of these cards um, bring them back. Memories from the from the, uh, the anime series, of course. I'm a big fan of that. Um, heroes, you know, I'm a little bit. I'm not so sure about heroes. I do think that it has its good parts, but um, I am definitely looking forward to uh, uh, to the new stuff uh, coming out soon. Vegeta striving to be the best. There, that's very nice. Of course, we are also looking for the cell, uh, the cell Zeno Unspeakable Abomination. That would be something that I'd like to pull. I mean, I suppose I can't complain too much when I've just got the uh, the Vegeta there, but uh, you know, we always want a little bit more, can't we? And of course, afterwards, after this video is all said and done, and after you know, uh, as soon as this video will actually be live, so you guys will be watching this right now. Uh, the cards, oh, look at that, look at that. Oh, I love it. Instinct surpass Son Goku. Wow. I just think they look so nice. Don't they? You can't not agree with me. Wow. So nice. But yeah, so sorry, as I was saying, as you're watching this video, all these cards uh, should be on our website. Let's put these over here for now. Uh, they can chill there. Um, so yeah, so don't waste any time. Get yourself over there. Get yourself over to, to totalcards.net. And get yourself the cards that you want, you know. You might have got a booster box, you might have got a couple. You might not have got the cards that you maybe wanted. And it's just so simple and so easy to just head over and just get what you want, guys. Um, if you guys didn't know as well, uh, which, I, which I hope that you do, but if you don't, we do have a gaming center. Um, it's been open quite a while now. So if you're in the area, then pop on down. Come see us all. Come have a game with us, be it Dragon Ball, be it Pokemon Magic, whatever you're into. Uh, we also have some even D&D nights on. Uh, one of the, the staff, uh, he's, uh, he's a really, really good DM, and I'm sure he'd be more than happy to uh, to incorporate you into, to, into some games, or if you just want to bring your friends down and just chill out, absolutely more than welcome to do so. I'll quick flick through these, I'll get a little bit faster. Uh, no, got a. Oh, it's the same. Kind of pretty much the same. Thing. Was the other one before? Same card at the end. Uh, but yeah, as I say, I'll get through these a little bit faster because I know that everybody wants to see the good stuff, and, and I do as well. So we'll keep going through that. There we go. Just a quick flick. Jump on. Supreme Kai. Time. Nice card. Very nice. But yeah, so anything you want to play at all, really, we accommodate pretty much everything if not everything we even have uh, on Mondays now we have for those of you that are interested in miniatures wargaming I suppose Warhammer would be the biggest one but anything else that you're into any other maybe smaller games maybe X-Wing or or uh, Star Wars Armada things like that we have Monday nights specifically for those type of events so you could come down with a friend or a couple friends and uh, set up a table there and uh, we can push all the tables for you guys and make a lovely, lovely battlefield. Now we use your guidance. Uh, yeah, so we, we could definitely do that. Um, certainly myself being involved in a number of them and I've always found it great. A couple of us play miniature games as well. So, you know, there's always somebody to play with down there. Ooh, dirty burst. Wow. I, you, you, you can see on camera the, the 
the shine there, but it just looks so nice in person as well, just with the gold from the beams. Oh, so nice, so very nice. We'll keep going, keep going. But yeah, usually at this point I'd be saying, well, oh, I hope we can get this, I hope we can get that, but maybe another, we'll see, we'll see. What's the chances, I guess? One in every six boxes for an SCR, is it, guys, I think? Maybe wrong there, but I guess the chances are uh, of us getting anything else are very, very low, because we shouldn't have really even got one out of these, these but, you know, we'll get lucky. But then we get lucky, means you guys get lucky, because you guys have the opportunity to purchase these cards. Um, which is great, you know? But I believe we still do have some of these booster boxes left in stock as well. So if you guys are interested, you know, you're seeing these cards and just thinking, wow, I really wanna, I really wanna get a piece of that. Then yeah, head over and pick yourself one up. Um, I know they are going very fast, so you might not wanna wait around too much. But we do have a couple left still, still in stock. And if you are coming down to the gaming center, then you know it, we'd be more than welcome to to go grab you one out out from the back, um, out from the warehouse for you guys. You know it's not only what's on display in the game center, but if you if you know you want something and you come in and maybe it's not on display there, then you know just ask, just ask one of the guys there, and I'm sure they'll be more than happy to uh, to get whatever it is that you need. Okay, going first, Chilaf, beautiful. Very green card that one, isn't it? Very green. Right, into the next. Kind of getting through these now. We've got a couple more there, and then on to the next two. And we'll see what we can do. This has got a bit of light there on them ones. I can't, I can't really see them. I'll put them in the middle a bit more. A bit easier for you guys. Some of my favourites, I suppose, there. There we go. Of course, this one, but especially this one as well. Maybe not as pricey, but the design. Insane. This is two trunks. Shock and death ball, another cool card from uh I wanna say maybe cross spirits this card does in, I'm not sure, I can't can't really remember. I think it does in cross spirits, yeah. I know that I definitely got a few too many well, maybe not a few too many, but certainly enjoyed it. Got a couple booster boxes of cross spirits when that first came out. Some cool stuff in there. I remember building a, a Jiren deck from it. Um, I didn't really know what I was doing at the time. That looks so nice with the blue and red. I really like that. I really like how they've done that. And the ultimate form, Sun Goku. Wow. So nice as well. Yeah, I remember building a Jiren deck. And I thought, yeah, I like Jiren. He's cool. I'll build a deck around him. And uh, it did turn out to be very good. Very, very good. Quickly found out. And it quite, it quite shocked me. But then, of course, all the hype got on it. And... Uh, not sure if it still is a good deck, but once Cross Spirits came out, it was it was very good. It was very good indeed. But the thing as well, it's just about you know having fun with this type of stuff. Maybe sometimes not always building the best decks that you possibly could, but also just you know building some of the you enjoy. For instance, you know your favorite character might be I don't know, like here it could be Vegeta. You could build a guess a Vegeta related deck, or maybe your favorite character is maybe. Um, <clears throat> Uh, Bardock, the Bardock deck. But yeah, I think that's sometimes a good way to go with these things instead of just always going for what's the best. Well, again, it does depend on your guys' preference. Are you entering tournaments? Probably not a good idea to go in with a deck that's uh, that's maybe not as good. You probably won't get very far. This is for Bardock there. Final Spirit Cannon. Right, that's the first one done. Quite happy with that. Um, some good stuff. Couple here, and I've got a couple more just to the side there. Some really cool, cool stuff in it. Cheetah. Farm some good cake in there. Um, so yeah, if you guys are interested in them, then then yeah, head over, pick one up. Don't wait before they're all gone, because you never know when they might be gone, and you'll be left a little bit disappointed. Oh, that's nice. I'm just going to say that for every card, you know, every single one that pops up. 
you probably get sick of me. Right, on to the next. A ball. July, surprise attack. Shen one. Very, very cool. Lovely Zamasu on the front of this one. If you guys want to drop down in the comments as well what your favourite character is in all of Dragon Ball, be it original Dragon Ball or Dragon Ball Z or Dragon Ball Super, and maybe why you think they're the favourite character. What about them makes you like them? Maybe is it something to do with um, maybe a bit of nostalgia for you? From maybe when you used to watch the show when you were younger, or maybe it's, maybe it's you just get into the show now and you've got a certain kind of attachment to a character. I know that for a lot of people, of course, it would be Goku, the standard. Nothing wrong with that. He's a great, great character. Oh, look at that, that's one. Kaioken Sun Goku. Concentrated destruction, absolutely. Looks like he's going to cause some destruction there. Very nice. Yeah. But yeah, and a lot of people, you know, I'd say Vegeta as well. He's come a long way since uh, the beginning. Became a different person. For the better, I'd say. Still, just that little bit, you know, lagging behind Goku. Just ever so slightly. He thinks he's getting close. And then Goku pulls something out the bag, you know. Vegeta does Blue Evolved and Goku was Ultra Instinct. Ah, uh, look at that. The young Broly. Oh, they launched their version. Is a gold stamp one, I think I'm correct in saying that? It's more so, well, gold, of course. Not shiny. Got another one here. Fly through these ones. As I say, guys, I'll try and get through them as fast as I can. Black temptation tool. That one looks really cool. Like the red and the, the red and the black goes really well, especially with the gold shine to it. Uh, see what else we can get. <clears throat> as you can see as well on this Mahi, is a lot of the products that we sell. So if you're just kind of maybe looking about and you think, oh yeah, I really like you know Star Realms, or I really like Vanguard, then yeah, check us out for sure. Might have some stuff that you might not even be able to get anywhere else, or you might struggle to get somewhere else. We have a great, great warehouse team. Myself, I am part of that team. And, you know, we do our best to get the orders out for you guys. As soon as you place it, we want to have that, want to have that packed up and ready to go as soon as we can. And more often than not, you know, if not, dare I say it all of the time, you will get your products when you want them. And I hope that continues to be the case. Because we want to keep our customers happy with Total Cards. And that is our number one priority, making sure that you guys have the content. And also... Oh, that's really nice. Do that, do that. And also, you know, good prices on stuff. Which is is a big, big thing. Very important. It's what we care a lot about here. On to the next. I'm not seeing anything too crazy out of these. Maybe I've maybe I've missed something. But so far, it's been okay. Let's say got the uh, got the cooler there, the SR and the the Kaioken SR. But yeah, nothing that I thought. You know, wow. Dragon Ball. That looks really cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Indeed. Right, we still haven't got the cell uh, cell zen on unspeakable abomination, but we'll keep going. We'll keep going. See what else we can do. Maybe as a master, it might be cool. I'd like to see a <coughs> rose, super saiyan rose, maybe super saiyan three. That's nice. Wanting the dark empire. Yes, indeed. Right, the next one. I think this is really handy. If, if you guys didn't know what I was talking about before, it's just something about this little, this little slit here that they put in packs. So instead of fit, you know, fidgeting on and trying to, you know, do all this, and all this is, it's, it's, it's as simple as that. And it's, it's a, it's a nice, lovely, rip down, 
you got your pack, your cards come out, there you go, and that's it. No damage, it's easy, no risk of doing anything like that. It's a lot quicker as well. Oh, Fuse and Rossi, this looks cool. Luis, the real guidance looks cool. Stop. Very nice, very nice. And of course, with the new set being announced as well, I think it's Battle of the Gods. Something like that, I think. Realm of the Gods, maybe? I can't exactly remember. But yeah, that, that, that looks cool. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta. Oh, so powerful. But yeah, that set being announced, I think there's a new rarity as well. Is it the God Rares? Comment if I'm wrong. Let me know, please. But yeah, I think that's what it is, and they, they're going to be cool. They're going to be very cool. Oh, green card, very green. Oh, almost to the end of this box. Speeding it up a bit more. Get to the good stuff. Oh, it's quite nice. Drink some fucking glass. And we all here at Total Cards obviously hope that you guys get some good pulls as well in your boxes. Make sure that we give everybody, you know, equal chance to get all the cards that they want. Here we go, next one. Freezer. Oh, Dimension Magic, is that the, the gold stamp one as well? I think that's a little bit, a little bit pricey, I believe. Uh, maybe, oh, I'm not sure if I could put a price on that one. Uh, I couldn't really say. But yeah, it will be up on the site, so you guys will be able to see that. That's nice. That's very nice. Here we are. Volt X sleeve. Pop that in. Making sure it's protected. Good prices as well, Volt X. I know I was talking about them a little bit earlier, but yeah, good prices. Very good prices. We've had some... Um, had some good deals on with them at the minute, so I think at one point our binders they, they dropped the price quite a bit. We were, we were able to uh, do a little sale on them, do a little bit of discount on them, and those guys flew out the shop. They I've never seen a product <laughs> I don't think go so fast as that. Never mind your Pokemon sets, but no, the Volt X binders them they went oh, they went so fast. I'm doing them in. Shine on the other side. I've got one a lot, and I've got a guy working here as well who's going to be especially keen to see that one. Have a look at that one and see what it's all about. Right, go on, next up, what we got? Giant ball there in the gold side. Last one, I think. Yep, last one. And then we'll go into the last box, and I'm going to even. Try go a little faster than what I've done now. That's good. I say I'll go a little bit faster, but then I see this and I'm looking at it for too long. Very nice. Very nice. Can we get another SCR? I wonder. Sorry, my head just popped a little bit there. The camera. Supreme Kai of Time. Very nice. Oh, okay. Okay. Giant Ball, we just have that one before as well. Nonetheless, very, very nice indeed. Go to the next one. Topo Righteous Aid. I like Topo as well. He's menacing looking, isn't he? I wouldn't want to run into him. Right, what we got next? Is this three? Some Goku? Sorry, I'll come up to the camera there for you. A bit far away. Try and go a bit closer. That's going to be a bit better. Dragon Ball? 
Another one of the Vegeta on the front. Fuse and Masu. Dude, he's rough. Ooh, I like that. I like that one. This one here. So we got first booster box, kind of my favourite pulls. Second booster box, and then we'll hold the third here. Four cards for every set. For every box, sorry. <clears throat> All the same set, of course. Right, oh, I'm sticking out a bit. Turn attack drops. Very cool. They are very cool. I'm not flying through these here. Eh? Right. Vegeta's striving to be the best. It's a little sell, but it's okay. We'll get a little lucky. Maybe we will. The last few. Oh, again. That. Super Saiyan. Blue. Gogeta. Next up. Time Magic. Not too bad, not too bad. We move on. We move on very swiftly. <clears throat> Android 17, ending crisis. I remember I made uh, an Android deck as well. Probably not a very good one, but a little bit fun. With a lot of the cards from Cross Spirits, yellow cards. I found that quite fun actually. I found it quite good. I didn't really win. Uh, maybe I didn't win at all, actually, <laughs> but that's fun. And that's always good, always. We do run uh, our own tournaments as well at the game center here at Total Cards. If if, if you're um, struggling to find us, you just go onto our website and there'll be there'll be links and maps. We even uh, you can you can phone us. Um, more than more than happy to give you all the information that you need. But yeah, a lot of it should be should just be already on our website. Everything that you should need to find should be on there. But yeah, uh, we do uh, Pokemon tournaments, Magic tournaments, Yu-Gi-Oh tournaments, all kinds of tournaments. Cost prizes as well, so there's something that's worthwhile for you guys doing. Uh, I know for the Magic, so nice, look at that. For a second, that I really like that one. Um, but yeah, for magic, you enter, you get your entry pack, your choice. And prizes afterwards as well, which is, which is great. Always makes playing more fun when there's something to play for, I think. Oh, that's nice. Can get a bit competitive though, as you would think. Which is fine, a little bit of healthy competition. Ooh, there's a leader, Kefla there, the Surge of Frosty. Very nice. But yeah, a bit of healthy competition, nothing wrong with that at all. You know, getting everybody involved is the main thing. And just getting people to have fun. Alright, we're almost through this one. I think, where are we at? Three, no. No, I'm not, is it? Yeah, five more after this one. Five more. So, we will see what we get. But, uh, as, as I say, I can't complain. It was the third or fourth pack there that got the, the best... <laughs> the best card or the, the card that I wanted most. The card that I wanted to pull. Set myself a goal before the video started. Thinking, yes, right. If I can get one thing on this video, I want to get that Vegeta. And that's what I got. So, yeah. Very, very good. Alright, next up. Next up. What we got? What we got? Dirty bones. And. Dimension Magic, yeah, very nice. I'll put that one right there. I'll put it in the right spot, but yeah. Put it in the I think the first deck I actually got, well it was one of the new ones because I, I only actually started kind of playing kind of around the time that it was Cross Spirits came out really. 
so not really that long ago but no I've been been hooked ever since and yeah I got the I know I think it was the the blue Vegito deck I can't remember exactly what it's called off the top of my head now but it was one of the newer ones I believe and I kind of used that one for a while uh, and I quite enjoyed that one uh, as well it's really good it's really good the Gorgito one as well, the red Gorgito one. Again, I couldn't tell you what that one was called. Useless remembering this stuff. And there we go, top it all off, that was the last one. Sheila the Beautiful. Very green. I can't believe how green this card is. I, 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 it's hurt my eyes when I'm looking at it, but yeah. There you are. There we go. Three booster boxes of Mythic Dragon Ball Super Card Game. Very happy with that. Can't complain. Got this lovely one here. I'm going to be extra, extra, super careful with that. But yeah, wow, 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 wow. So nice. But yeah, that's going to be it. Uh, if you guys want to leave any questions for us in the comments or anything that you want to let us know, uh, as I said before, let us know about your favorite characters. Let us know why they're your favorite characters. No, I like to have a little read through these and see what people are thinking. Um, personally, I'm I'm going to be a bit boring. I'll I'll save Vegeta for myself, just because of watching the the show as a kid and just seeing how much he's progressed. And he's just so cool, you know. He's maybe, he's maybe a bit too edgy, but yeah, he's he's cool. He's cool. Uh, and yeah, that's going to be it. If you, if you guys want anything else, as I say, if you if you, if you want to pick up a Mythic booster box or you want to pick up some of these single cards, then head on over. Uh, it's TotalCards.net, and yeah. You will find a, a, a huge, huge array of products. As I said before, all spread out on here. Anything you see here, we're going to have something, or you know, quite a bit of stuff from these, from these things. Be it TCGs, Pokemon, um, Magic, wherever Magic is on here, I can't see it right now. <laughs> Vanguard, anything like that. But yeah, like I said before, there's all the accessories. You know, I'll give Genic classics. Ultra Pro, Ultimate Guard, uh, and of course Vault X as well. But yeah, definitely recommend if if you if you're looking for something else or anything like that, then yeah, give give Vault X go, give it a go. Why not? What have you got to lose? Um, but yeah, that's gonna be it. That's gonna be it, guys. So hope you have enjoyed watching the video. Uh, it's been myself, Josh, and yeah, that's gonna be about it. Please. Uh, Please like the video, it would be great, it would give us a, give us a big help out. Uh, and subscribe to see what else is coming in the future. Be it for Dragon Ball or be it for any other TCGs. As I can imagine if you're watching this, you probably like a couple of the TCGs and that type of stuff. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it. So have a lovely day guys. Thank you very much once again. Uh, and I'll hopefully see you next time. See you soon. Bye.